Picture this, it's five o'clock on a Friday evening in your favourite bar with your best friends. If a fly on the wall was to report on your sober behaviour in that scenario, they'd likely see open natural hand gestures, high energy, enthusiasm, great storytelling and frankly a refreshing lack of business speak. In short, effective presentation skills. So why is it that many of us fall to pieces when it comes to presenting in business? It's five o'clock in the pub again. When you're relaxed and in your element, you get straight to the point. You drop long formal sentences and speak colloquially. Any other way and your friends would probably get bored and eventually stop wanting to meet up. So here are five Pink Elephant top tips on how to present informally. Number one, start with the point. Tell everyone about the most important thing in your presentation. The results of your research, the big breakthrough you've had. Number two, Drop formal language. Instead of we are, use we're. Avoid acronyms and technical speak, paint pictures, tell stories. Talk about real people and real examples. Number three, demonstrate energy and enthusiasm. At the end of a recent course we did in Edinburgh, a senior executive told us he was exhausted. And rightly so, he was utterly infectious in his enthusiasm for the total of nine minutes that he presented across three presentations over the whole day. Aim to exhaust yourself in your presentation. People buy people, and if they buy into your energy, they are more likely to buy what you're selling. Number four, use natural body language. For lots of people, this is the hard part. When walking through airport security at the likes of Glasgow, Edinburgh or London, for example, you'll be well aware of the fake smile, the one we used to say, don't search me please, I'm not a terrorist. I often feel it's making me look more guilty, but it feels the same way when you aim to smile naturally during a presentation. With practice, it will come, and to help, why not draw a smiley face on your notes in front of you? Whatever gets you smiling, do it. Your audience will see someone that's comfortable and feeling relaxed, and they'll feel the same way in your presence. Lastly, number five, prepare limited notes. A common mistake we often see made with presentation skills and public speaking is that natural means unprepared. We dislike someone being overscripted and so we go the opposite way. But if you really want to come across as off the cuff, prepare well and limit your notes. Now you'll be able to glance down and see important figures as well as knowing where you're going at all points. Well, that's all we have for you on the Pink Elephant vlog for today. But if you found this helpful, get in touch to book a training session for you or your team. And of course, follow us on social media for the very latest. I've been Colin Stone from Pink Elephant. Enjoy your next presentation and your Friday evening at the pub too.